This is Darthwing here. It appears that my video has lured you into my lair. Now subscribe or suffer my wrath. My name is Pennywise, the dancing clown. Huh? Do you want a balloon, Georgie? I know you do. Huh? I'll come here and I'll give it to you. I want you to have it. Ha ha ha! So here is my other Pennywise the Clown horror game as a compliment to the other game. Now this is how you wake up and I'm gonna jump ahead here and first I want to preface this. I accidentally discovered this glitch the very first time I played by double tapping or pressing the the hide button too many times when you're trying to hide quickly because of the door knocking and you'll see what happens. As you can see the clown, he actually starts coming into the room. The key is still not in the drawer, but there he is. He's coming in, he just he completely ignores you, walks over there, he just turns around and goes back out. And then you watch, keep watching this, suddenly the key will suddenly appear in the drawer. So here's the other thing he does. He'll actually like push you on top of the, uh, the cabinet there. And then if you follow him out the door, you actually just then just disappear and another thing too you see the house is still there you can see inside the house right here and it says it's still locked this is what's supposed to happen where well, the house disappears here's another thing that happens when you tap the skip button while he's walking around he just disappears so here is what's supposed to happen you wake up like this and you look around and then you're supposed to here go under the bed and then stay under the bed and then he walks in and you just watch him as he walks around and you watch him as he walks out Oh, I lost my recording several times. So this is after several different recordings because it, it just stops recording for some reason. Um, so that was kind of frustrating. Okay, you can actually go back under the bed, which is funny because I did, couldn't do that once he was walking. Anyway, uh, so here's when you, the key appears, which it looks like it disappears for some reason. Okay, then you go over to the door. Oh, we got some gold, which I picked up multiple times already. And I usually take a look around. You get to see the different um, things on the wall here. Apparently, there's this guy is also a gamer. Apparently, has some ideas, things he wants to do, and then various references to certain things as you can see on the walls. Even alien creatures. And yep, there's some more posters. Alright, nothing else to see here. And then I just head out the door. Now, this is happening. Um, oh, you have to see, so you have to be careful. Like, uh, hold on, like, okay, I go out the door. Now, this is just demonstrating. See, the house is gone here. So, this is demonstrating, I think, what I did the first time when I hit the actually hit the down button when I was moved in the movement. So, I actually was walking like this. And I was like, what the heck is going on? And you're like, you think you're like going into the ground or something and you realize you're just crawling. Um, but another thing you have to be careful is you tap the up button rather than swipe up or else you'll open up your, basically open up your control panel and then it just takes forever, like freezes. This game makes your whole phone sluggish for some reason, which is one of the difficulties of recording. Uh, now this is what I was really confused the first time I was play this. I had no idea what I was supposed to do, but here you can see. Oh, oh, this is um. So this is something you can do. You can go right off the end of this and go right off the edge of the map, and you're just caught. And this is another thing here. At this here, you can't fall off that that thing for some reason. Weird, weird thing. Anyway, so here actually is where it is. See, this is where it's confusing. Like you think you have to use it there, and you're just like, where, where is this thing? You know, you're trying to put it in the. You know, the train, you can't figure out, you're like, what the heck? You're like, well, where, where do I put this thing? It turns out you actually have to go behind this thing and drop the ticket in there, but I, it's, 
inserting it here, but I can't. Like, what, what am I supposed to drop in there? And I was like, oh, wait a second. Oh, it's a ticket. I'm trying to drop it. And you have to drop it to the side, which is weird. And then the train goes off, goes off the rails here. You see this thing. Whatever that is. And you just go around. Oh, wrong way. Wrong way, buddy. All right. You need to go over here. Oh, I, I just actually leave without it. And then I realize, oh, whoops. I forgot whatever that was. So I go, I can't, I can't go up there. I'm like, oh, what, what? I can't move for some reason. Oh, this way, buddy. Okay, so then I actually go and pick up whatever it is here. Wind planks. And then I try to uh, pick that up. There we go. And this is where I uh, can't go off the ledge. Keep walking around. Do, 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 do. And the most funny thing here, the hint said, I have to use the wooden planks, but it doesn't say where. So I go up here, just kind of fooling around, and uh, this guy ambushes me. I was like, what the hell? All right, I have to start over again. The starting sequence. And this is here where I go back again. And I take a look around. There's actually a secret here. That's one of my secrets I found in that particular recording. And here is a save panel. I go, oh, there it is. I save it. Now, uh, be aware that this is, this is uh, another thing he ambushes me. <laughs> in the save center that happens in one of my recordings so here is another uh, secret I found it's up in this area another item and this is a time where he ambushes me and I'm watching him and I see him coming up and I'm like oh where is he where is he where is he and of course he uh, goes in where I don't see him he's right there he follows me and oh, I go right into a dead end and he ambushes me so here's what you're supposed to do Supposed to go over here, supposed to drop this wood plank here. And then you go over. You grab whatever, you grab this water bottle. And I have no idea what to do with this water bottle. It's not clear. Makes no sense. I'm trying to tap the uh, hint button. Oh no, that's where this is where I go to save. Yeah, this is where I go to save. So I don't have to do it all over again. And he doesn't ambush me this time. Um, and then I'm trying to find it. Uh, I'm trying to tap the help button. Nothing happens. <laughs> so then I turn back around and go this way. Hey, yeah, and this is where I get a hint. And it says use the water bottle and you go over the carousel. Of course, I go over the carousel. And I'm like, I have no idea. I'm like, wandering around. Like, what, what do I do with this? So I like try, you know, like using the water bottle and things. Like what, what the heck? And this is where I hear him walking and I run and hide. And then you see him coming. And then he walks away. And okay, now he's away. I've cut out some parts here where I really had like no idea what I'm supposed to do with this water bottle. Like, what do I do with this? Like, and finally I see this thing. And I'm like, oh, something's hidden under the blood. Oh, there's the code. Oh, okay. And then it spins around and around. I didn't realize that was a code until just now. And it goes faster and faster and faster and faster. And somehow I don't get flung off. And you just saw him right there. And eventually it starts slowing down. And then he says, here. Now I know the code, which I didn't realize at the time that that code was actually on the horse. And that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed your time in my lair watching my video. 
reminding you to stay safe and be happy. I will see you in the next video. Hmm, maybe I won't. You haven't subscribed. I gave you a warning, fool. Now fry!